Hey, this is Brick Drum with Printabot.com, and I'm printing this part for Autodesk. They've got this cool project where they're using Fusion 360 to do PCB design, which fits inside this printed part, and has a speaker and a speaker grill that's laser cut, a nice wood case that's CNC'd. And so I fired up some of my refurbs for the bot farm. And I'm printing, 21 printers are printing right now, and the total parts is 112 parts going at the moment. Uh, various models, so I've had to slice for these older simples. I've played around with several slices, and I'm testing this slice right now on beds of four to see how they do, and I can compare them to see what kind of quality each bot is spitting out so I can see if there's anything that needs to be taken care of. I usually just go through, check the belts, and the uh, first layer, and then I let them go. Uh, I don't mind throwing away a bunch of parts if I have to. Uh, it's really nice to use the Simple Pro because I can run all of them. That's how many Simple Pros are online right now. All green lights. They don't have to stay connected. I just use this to upload the project file, which has two individual files. And then depending on which one I choose, this one has just started, so I'm trying just three. Uh, this one has proven itself, so I picked 12. So anyway, got a couple more over here. A couple of betas, the red means beta, so they sometimes need some help. I got these fans on the side. Uh, just hooked up a fan on that one. Sometimes I put down an extra layer of tape if it's uh, instead of recalibrating, I just want a quick down and dirty fix. So I just put down a new piece of tape, had a failure there. So I definitely need to improve the uh, cooling on these old simples. I guess the refurbs, since uh, we don't print fan shrouds for them typically, um, I had this one laying around. But there's uh, another style. Better cooling means better prints. Where did I put that? Oh yeah, this stuff. This was a uh, a blower fan. It's in the back, so I'm gonna go through and make sure they all have blower fans. I don't know if you can see that print, but it's pretty good. It needs maybe a little bit more retraction. But anyway, just thought I'd show you uh, doing some bot farm printing for Autodesk.